Hello, 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 everyone. Welcome in, welcome or welcome to some uh, off-schedule liberation, because today we're going to be jumping into some Helldivers. The automatons have returned, and we're going to put them right back where they came from. I want to say hello to everyone stopping by so early as we've just getting started here. Hello there, NSF, Boop the Snoots, Epic Gamer Bros, Theta, Alex and Dragon, Mike, Epic Gamer Person, uh, Carbon Beaker, Whiskey the Twisty, Forcefield. How y'all doing? I can't believe the bots already retaliated. I don't know, right? Ministry of Truth told me they were exterminated. Apparently, the bots are more seditious than we expected. <laughs> How are you guys doing tonight? Looking forward to doing some uh, gaming. Let's go ahead and load up. It looks like there's been a patch, and the uh, the patch has been a. Uh, the patch claims to have fixed a great deal of crashes, which we kind of expected. So we'll uh, jump into that if possible. First stream you ever got? Feeling good? Good. I'd love to hear it. That's the kind of goodness we want to hear. Public service announcement. Super Earth. Our home. Prosperity. Liberty. Hi there. <laughs> Democracy. Our way of life. Oh, hello. But freedom doesn't come free. No! Sweet liberty! No! <laughs> Look familiar? Scenes like these are happening all over the galaxy right now. You could be next. That is, unless you make the most important decision of your life. Prove to yourself that you have the strength and the courage to be free. Join the Helldivers. Become part of an elite peacekeeping force! Yeah, that still hasn't gotten old. That's it's a beautiful. That's a beautiful intro. I love to see it. You guys, join, uh, we'll be doing one round of quick play, jumping into uh, saving some saving some others. Um, then we'll start up the. Uh, then we'll start up a queue to get you guys getting here. Let's see what, what else have we got going on. Dispatch priority broadcast. The automatons have returned, as we've completed the terminated major order. All right, so it looks like we're refarming the uh, the terminator, the uh, terminates. Let's see. The automatons are a far greater threat to liberty than we were led to believe. Oh my! Allied destroyer has joined squadron. Incoming message from Super Earth. Surprise. They're pushing deep into Super Earth territory. Okay. Uh, so that got exciting. Vlada Sector, they did actually reclaim Cyberstan. That I could have seen coming. I did see coming, but uh, it's nice. It's, it's interesting to see that they actually did it. We've got multiple defense missions, planets going around. And. Uh, Oh boy, is it looking like they've they've pushed in something fierce. So it looks like we're playing defense on Mankenth. Mankenth. This is oh boy, it's one of these worlds. All right, sweet. Oh, 
All right, then I'll get myself set up. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to do quick play for the first time around. So rip theta, you will be missed. Uh, we'll be opening up to we'll be opening up to uh, has left squadron. opening up to queuing up with the crew after the first round. We do like to do quick play for the first round. I run the scorcher dominator. Ah, I'll run dominator. It handles itself better than the scorcher without support. And then we'll jump into quick play here. Hello there, Agent. Welcome in. This goes Cyberstan AO. You really like the new defend high value assets mission? Really fun. I am looking forward to it. I haven't I haven't tried it out yet. Uh jumping in for the first time here. It's the worst that can happen yet, but I've heard there's a new mission type and I'm very excited. Try it out. Impressive freedom is vigilance. Yes. Hello there, Keith. Welcome in. Yeah, Crazy Mouse. The uh, I am perpetually impressed with these new, with the new stuff that the uh, developers have been adding in. I do want to quick point out something, uh, game related. Uh, new science has been dropped. We've had some great work done by the community. We're going to be talking about this more in depth a little bit later. As right now, we're jumping into a mission. Alright, so we've got Retrieve Essential Personnel. Okay, so we can go medium with this. This is going to be one of these missions, which means going to take things carefully. Um, I think I'm going to roll with this, this. I'm going to go Auto Cannon. I think I'll go Auto Cannon. And EMS. Roll with this and uh, bring on our favorite of the medium armors. Alright. Do what do you want? Minefield is actually valuable on those, you think? It's interesting. Uh, minefield has always been pretty okay on the point hold missions. Um, but we've got. It's just difficult to use them effectively without causing problems. Oh, about slowly falling back as they attack you. Interesting. I'm interested in testing it out. Will we, will we be able to join? Yeah, yes. After after we do a quick play mission, I'll be opening up to the community. Also, the plasma one squirt you now. Ayo. Good morning, then, Laura. How are you doing today? Alright, so we break this. And then we do this. Uh, this is the place to put you. And we get a weapon here. Alright, so because this is farm territory, we're going to be struggling something fierce. Uh, but I'm going to try to manage these two buttons and uh, work with that. Uh, when things get tense, I will be falling back to this button only and ignoring this one. The new mission type, which you can open and close the big blast doors. Ayo. I missed. Well, of course they're going to land here. Oh my god, It's they're starting off with multiple hulks already. The dreadnoughts, they come. This one sucks. Yeah, this one, this one's really very unpleasant. That's one down, and I think the other one is still up, but I can't see it, so I can't do anything about that. It's punching our dudes. Alright, press the button. There is a cyclone looking at me and I- Ow! Ah! Ow! For the love of ow! Thank you. Alright, I mean, we already at the- I think we're already at the point where we have to give up the, uh, the other one. Just because stuff keeps spawning over here on this side. Alright. bad.
They're coming through the bushes. All right. Took that. We got multiple players down. Let's get you launching over here. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, this is bad. Yeah. All right. Okay. All right, looks like he's trying to get us to reset. And the obelisk boom has found us, which is exciting. He reinforced us back inside, which is a mistake. Why can't I? Thank you. I could have sworn those shots were going through him, like physically through him. There is a devastator there, so that was always going to end. Unfortunately, the teammates survived long enough to make the whole uh, resetting process difficult. Uh, I have a serious uh, interest in committing friendly fire here. It would genuinely make the experience easier, but I think we're going to try for it anyways. And the reason for that is when you're trying to reset, everyone has to leave. You can't half measure it. Everyone has to be gone. And it looks like we have at least one player who refuses to leave, and therefore we have at least one player who will prevent us from resetting. As long as you have one player who prevents you from resetting, you can never reset, and therefore you can never win. Uh, it's one of those missions where making mistakes like that just costs you the game, and there's really no two ways about it. Yeah. Pretty certain... Oh, there was one of the players here who left. Interesting. Oh, I can see that. It's bad here. Oh wow, I'm not alive. I'm gonna burn to death, but I got the button. Pulling their phone fire doesn't work that well in this context. Looking like a reset, we're gonna have to back off and uh, come back in after it despawn. You're not wrong. We can still try though. Uh, yeah, Bucks, by, uh, by resetting. Looks like they don't want to reset, which is going to make this entire experience. It's going to make this entire experience very difficult. Very, very difficult. Tank down. Alright. Good. Alright, so now that everyone's dead, I can reset. Well, that's unfortunate. Shouldn't have been sitting there with the beacon. Alright, looks like we got pushed off. If we back away far enough, we can uh, get a despawn and then we'll uh, push back in.
Hmm. Alright, well, I was hoping to get some gear out of that. There's a whole extra patrol here. Drop detected. There it is, there's a chance to get in. not going to hold the button until uh, so I am being chased by unpleasantry. Alright, so with those dropships landing over there, they will force despawn creatures from the main and drop them over there, which means we're going to see creatures that are, assuming they're not in combat, uh, they will be uh, despawning here and spawning behind me, which is where I want them to be. That's just deeply unfortunate. Right, can I get back in now? Get out of all your rockets. Can we get in? Um, I'm really hoping this fire is not... There's a spot here I can get through the fire. That'd be nice. Notice there's not a lot of creatures here anymore. As I say, there's one rocket devastator chilling up on the land landing pad there. Hmm. All right, so someone reinforced me over here, so I'm gonna pull the pin on myself. Dude, he reinforced on the wrong side of the world. Why? All right, there we go. I think this is not gonna make it. We needed to reset way sooner. You can't have someone on these missions that's uh, not not playing, or someone who's playing that degree of suboptimal. Like, if it takes us two minutes to reset up it's it's over you can't can't do that this mission doesn't permit that kind of uh those kind of errors you will lose right. good news is we're getting more civilians run through That's bad. Alright, can I get you here? There we go. Got it. Oh. Pain. Mild pain. Pain nonetheless. Alright, we're about to get overrun here. Go prone because I'm about to get knocked several flavors of a round. Uh, killed two civvies there, which is unfortunate. Third one looking like he's making it. Ow! I can't switch weapons. Now I can switch weapons. Alright, up to 44. Nice. We have no more reinforcements, although we're getting another reinforcement up here in a few seconds. Unfortunately, we're also getting uh, an, a, the next wave of bot drops in our location, and there is a heap load of flamethrower approaching as well. Can I press button again? It's about to get bad. This is this is what death looks like. Uh, there's a shield boy in front and multiple hulks. Yeah, okay. That's the end. Almost got it. We were just we were just one, just one away, which is usually how that goes. So close. So close, so far away. That Hulk slapping the civilian was amazing. It happens, it happens. Civilian defense? Yeah, yeah. Civilian defense are a little, a little intense. Alright. 
So, we are going to legislator or family values. <laughs> Try the new mission yet? Not yet. Looking forward to it. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and open up the lobby. If those who come, those who wish to join can come and join. So if you were trying to hop on before, now is your chance to do so. Hop on in. Missile defense is cool. Civic defense is just painful. I like the idea of civic defense. It just... It's incredibly punishing compared to a vast majority of uh, compared to a vast majority of the other missions. Like most people drop on it just saying, oh, let's just stop and kill bots, which is fine up until you can't kill bots. Like you have to actually get some serious level of good. And making mistakes, as we saw several players make, uh, just doesn't. Uh, you lose. You you just lose if you do, and that's all there is to it. Welcome in, Willy Man. Orbit synchronized. All right. So I've not played this mission before. This mission type before. Let's see if we can manage it. Is this the new one? Yes, yes it is. This is indeed the new one. Uh, I'm going to work off of the assumption it's a point hold style, so I don't need to be bringing a lot of running around. I think we're going to run with the same loadout. As the Civi Extract. Looks like we got a regular motor user. We'll see how that works out. Well, hello there. Warning. Nuclear launch detected. Kalijah coming in and dropping the nuclear support. That looks suspiciously like hell bomb options. <laughs> Welcome in, Kalijah. How are you doing today? It was loving Shad dropping that support oh, already. Taking also, that top spot down, so far. Triangle up, triangle reverse, oh god, it down, speaks this up, one. Triangle, play button down, triangle up, triangle. Oh, good lord. Ah. <laughs> uh. If only, if only. Just have to switch your heavy armor, took the shield to a AoE for point defense. I mean, it's good. The heavy armors are great. Considering the humans just attempt to eradicate the automatons with the bigger automaton spawns, Forex at least. Uh, at some point. Triangle, 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 triangle. Alright, I'ma just go this way, because I don't know what's over here, but I presume it's going to be nice to spread out some- Oh, hello! We have usable emplacements. Oh, I see! It is actually a one-way-in, one-way-out situation. Which means we probably want to go into the outer walls here. Okay. <laughs> I like it. Alright. Buttons pressed. Okay, so we're definitely closing the outer gates here. Like, 100%. Alright. This is, this is what I was hoping for. I can only imagine these doors are gonna get blasted, but there's no reason not to no reason not to uh, close them. Uh, let's go ahead and open this for now, so we can fall back. Those definitely have ammo. This is a beautiful position, by the way, because it's covered from the left, so you can't get shot from the left, but you can still shoot that way. Right. 
Got a little bit of extra supplies here. Alright, sweet. Uh, this looks suspiciously like incomplete terrain. Why did that get this? Why did that ship fall down? Oh, I think mortars. Oh, what kind is that? Eagle airstrike. I would need to not be here. Oh, they literally drop directly on top of it. Okay, well, that's just several flavors of disappointing. They drop inside the base, which I guess isn't the most on an, which I guess isn't the most irrational thing for them to do, but um, it's a little bit unfortunate. Shred that. I think I got a hit in its weak spot. Alright, just casually wrap out a bunch of them. That's what I'm looking for here. Uh, those can live there. I'm pretty certain it's the mortars that are taking those out. Which is interesting to me. didn't quite work as I wanted it to. Got it first. Defend generator until all rockets have launched. If, I like what it's called evacuate high value assets and it's launching rockets. Which those actually didn't look like kinetic payload. Or they didn't look like explosive payload style rockets, so I think I think it is actual I think it is actual material. Ow. Ow. Okay. Um, this looks a little overwhelmed. She is unfortunate because my gear is out there. Oh, there's just... Unpleasantry in the form of several tanks. Okay. The doors don't last very long, it would seem. Uh, but that's, you know, fine. Uh, that's a orbital. Interesting. Can I get my gear, or is that just not gonna happen? Good news is, I got my gear. Bad news is, I'm dead. Okay. Are they transport rockets? I think so. That's what I think they are. The shields are counterproductive. I am going to destroy that shield. And that will give us an opportunity to fight back. some of these are dropping inside the uh, exterior wall. There's a lot of tank. That's uh, one less tank. Ooh, oh, hello. Hello, Hulk. You need to stop being here. I need to get away from that. Uh, 
Uh, this is a threat. It is no longer a threat. Okay. This is another threat. I need it to be away. It is no longer a threat. We're missing someone on this side. So I'm going to go over here. Help with this. There's so many tanks. We are stacking their corpses so high that they're struggling to actually move. Which makes me happy. This this makes me very happy. Uh, what did I... Why am I getting back blasted? I don't have a gun. I dropped my gun in the process. This is bad. Alright. Armor coming in clutch. Uh, I got hit by someone's orbital, and it broke every part of my body, and then I died to falling damage. Uh, have you tried to hold R to change the fire rate in the auto cannon? Yeah, I'm aware. You can go fully automatic on it, which is it does an impressive amount of uh, velo of uh, rate of fire. But the problem with it is that it really doesn't work very well versus bots, because bots are uh, kind of they're very all or nothing style in their uh, in their design. Either you're hitting them in their weak spot and killing them, or you're hitting them in their armored spot and not hurting them. And the auto cannon is not immune to this effect. So just ramping up the rate of fire doesn't solve the problem. And it just makes it harder to hit their weak spots. So we just don't. That and the recoil on it gets kind of intense. This mission type? I do like this mission type. I like it a lot. Let's get some anti tank rockets going through. Hello. Ow. I feel like I'm fighting players a lot, and this displeases me. Just drop this over here. We need someone on the other side again. So I will be jumping my way over there. We lost one. Yep. I believe I got a friendly fire hit with that. And it's send this a bit further out this time. This right here is a moment where rapid fire auto cannon would be usable. Oh, that's bad. Just trying to punch through a bunch of the eviscerators. Alright, I will now be on this left side here, hoping to assist. Yeah, I saw I saw it hit the shield. out here. Oh, that's bad. Hundred percent auto cannon is bugs. You shot yourself in the back in the uh, twice in the back. Yeah, uh, that's happened to me a few times. Alright, good job with this. Wow, this is just this is a lot. Is that tank still alive? No, it is not. Oh, boy. For both HMG emplacements to carry machine guns? Yeah, 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 yeah. The, uh, 
we started with we I think we still have another HMG mission and placement back there that just comes as part of the map. Uh because it seems like a great idea on this map. It really does. Armor. I mean, the HMG's emplacement still shreds them. Armor or no. Unless you're shooting something like a Hulk in the front. Uh, their armor is generally not heavy enough to stop the HMG. And it works really well. Especially against these Eviscerator types. Because it just does enough raw DPS to chunk through their uh, quite tanky HP pool. There are tanks on top of tanks. Alright, we have once again put ourselves in a position where we are stacking one side and leaving ourselves vulnerable to problems. Uh, that's not more than I wanted. Alright, so I'll stay over here with King. No, get off the mortar, please. Thank you. Go. Why are there flamethrower hulks so often? Because we are squishy biologicals that die to fire, that die very quickly to fire. this. Assuming the crash behavior is fixed. It has been, the devs have claimed it has several sources of uh, crashing has been fixed. We didn't crash last round, which is good. It's a good start. God, the amount of just carnage out there is disgusting. Why am I using a dominator? Ow. Ow. Those, those mortars, they hurt. They hurt a lot. Uh oh. That's coming right here, isn't it? Alright. Imagine if we had non dusty sight lines and could. I got a brief reprieve here. I think a big part of it is a number of the dropships have been shot down, causing substantial uh, AI scuffing, and in doing so, limiting the amount of things that can actually come get us. Because it's it's breaking the AI pathing. It's in the tank. Sight line over here. There we go. Uh, let's get the uh, sentry back over here. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. Let's go. I would like to view over here, please. great for sentry turrets? It is. It really is. Whew. Well, that got exciting. Yeah, I like this mission. I really like this mission. It is definitely on the easier side, or so it would seem. Um, but that's something they could adjust. 
because this mission is fun. This mission is very fun. I like it. I like what I'm seeing here. I like it a lot. Everything is on fire. Everything is always on fire. How fast you die the fire. I would literally last longer walking into a furnace, naked. Yeah, after the, uh, the last patch when they did some uh, the flamethrower fixes, it I'm going to describe it as a scuffed fire. This is like playing tower defense. It is. Even the shoot down the ships makes it so much easier. Yes, but it does so in a way that's scuffy. The it shoots down the ships and it um. It doesn't kill the creatures. It leaves them alive, just standing there staring at you angrily. So that just doesn't feel good. But hmm, it's a. Uh, it is a thing. Uh, Alright, so now we've got the painful version. Where it's the escort civilians. Scientists. So good luck. We're going to need it. You can just run around looting samples and baiting drops. Please don't because you won't bait the drops because that's not how the drops work. Uh, you need more than one player doing that. Like you need all you need you actually need all four players doing that in order to bait the drops. Um it's not like bugs. No, it's not like bugs. Because the bots will drop around the facility they drop around the players or around the facility so if all four of us are together and out in the world um if all if we're all together and around the world then it will drop on top of us and then we can run in and do the objective but if that's not the case then they'll just spawn directly on top which is unfortunate How much does democracy cost? It's free. Democracy is always free. This is auto cannon town. I'm a fan of auto cannon. I've always liked the auto cannon. I just didn't usually run it because it was a bit heavy. It, 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 I've, I've, as I've gotten more experience with the game and I've been familiar with uh, how to run heavier equipment. Like how to how to move properly and how to go faster. Therefore, I can take heavier equipment and still keep up with an acceptable degree of alacrity. Oh God! It's this all over. It's the same. It's the farm. Button pressed. Water out. Fence destroyed. Uh, no one's pressing the safe button, so I'm gonna go press the safe button. Hmm. Button pressed. Alright, sweet. Uh, looks like we're not getting the first 10 in before the bot drop, which is unfortunate, but is this little world we live in. Uh, and away we go. Missed. Didn't miss this time. Alright. Come on. I've got a press button. That's bad. That's really bad. Got it. 
Ow. I need this to, to stop shooting these dudes. Hello. We are wiping already, which is really bad. Shield broke fast. Yeah, it tends to not last very long in this environment. It lived. Ow! That would have killed me if it wasn't for democracy itself. Missed the shot. Come on. Got it. Alright. Button pressed. Let's get this going out here. I need more. Go over here. Solid hits. No chopping down the civvies, please. Let's go over here. What is, what is, what is this? What's going on here? You. I see. Right, button pressed. We need to get to pressing those other buttons. This is what's happening. I was wondering, because I was like, there's surely there's one of these shooting through the floor here. It was. You can drop, you get CC locked to death. Yeah, that's why I'm dropping you over here where it's relatively safe. Alright, that'll go down. Boy, this is the time to drop this, isn't it? Ah, did I fire the last shot? I did. That's unpleasant. Alright, I'm out of stratagems. We're only halfway through. Okay, I think this is this is a wipe. Alright, I'm gonna start heading out. Let's see if we can't reset this. We did not do a particularly uh, high quality job of holding the line. Alrighty, uh, let's see. Can auto cannons kill hulks from the front? Yes, yes, they can. Revive a weight. This is a uh, weight. Shoot, held that. Yeah. My right, bot drop detected. That means it's our cue to head back in. All right, back in we go. As you'll note, those bots are now dropping either on me or you two. It looks like it's between. This means that things are being forced despawned. So you spawn over here, and then we immediately run back in. Okay.
Uh, hello. I did not see you there. Alright. Press buttons. There we go. Can you get both those buttons pressed there? Correct. This one, he's on that. You two are on those. Alright, we're getting civilians in again. Just nice quick, uh, nice quick reset problem solved. Press that button. We've got at least a few more seconds before, yeah. Before the next uh, bot drop happens. And then it's going to kick off all over again. Got no civilian, direct civilian casualties. Do you have any opinions of weapons that need to be buffed? Um, there's a few outliers that come to mind, but nothing that's, like, critical. Weapons are in a pretty good place right now. We could already leave, just compress again. We could. I do find it's usually better to stick around and hold the line for a little bit. Once you get overwhelmed, then you just leave. The problem isn't that we get pushed off. The problem is that it takes us too long to leave once we get pushed off. Like once once things once things destabilize, we gotta leave and come back later. That's that's the problem. And not leaving come back later is is what gets us in trouble. Yeah. Yeah, so we've got CVs running. And we're holding the line fine enough. There's another tank. Just clear them off. There we go. Uh, I'm in danger. Run samples? That's up to you guys. I have no need for them, but you know this. Alright. I can't see my reticle. I'm gonna change it to my uh, usual vertical color. It's very bright out here. Ow! Okay. I'm seeing leaks. I haven't. I tend to not keep up with the leaks. Like, I'll see them every so often, but I don't go actively searching for them, you know? Backpack. Okay. Let's see if we can blast these dudes here. Alright. That's several flavors of knockback. Alright, he punched me into him, which is unfortunate for me, specifically. Alright, so many explosions. Ooh, Lord have mercy, for these shall not. Stayed in long enough to get to go. 
We are definitely getting in the Pelican as soon as possible. Ow. Oh, nope, that's bad. Get in. You can do it. Dive. Oh, he got not. Oh. <laughs> he got CC'd so hard. Oh, no. Uh, using the shield generator. Uh, one of our teammates is using the shield generator, and I'm not convinced it's a strong. I'm not convinced it's a strong option. Like it, it, it works. It's not a detriment most of the time. It's just I don't consider it to be a strong option. I haven't seen it get used particularly well. And I haven't been able to use it particularly well myself. Yeah, rip crag, he didn't make it. That grenade and Hulk waiting on landing, I know. It's brutal. Uh, but success, we did it. That is by far the hardest mission in the game, and we have we completed it. Welcome back. Well done. My tea is very hot right now. Sweet. Yes, after this act, he'll be rotating out for those who wish to come and join. The Fire of Liberty, yes. Oh, boy, is this one... This looks like a drop it extract. Yeah, this is a drop it extract angle. Which, for the record, you'd never want to drop directly on extract because half the time there's stuff there waiting for you. I'm between the Scorcher and the Dominator. Slugger's always good. The Punisher's always nice. I'll stick with the Dominator for now. Dommy is quite, quite the effective tool. Do I want to run 500 kg? I think not. But if I'm running auto cannon. I will have the extra space to run 500. Yeah, it's nice. I'll, I'll run it, I'll run it. No reason not to run it, I suppose. Let's go. The plasma scorcher. Yeah, it's a good it's a good weapon. Unpopular opinion, but you don't like the X. That's not an unpopular opinion. That is it is most people dislike leaks and spoilers. Well, like a vast majority. More useful than the slicker and defense missions? I don't know. No, no. I, I would say it is, it is more useful than the slugger and defense missions, but slugger is good. I like, don't sleep on the slugger. range over the slugger yes the um the exploder the explodey element of it does its damage regardless of distance thoughts on multiple sentry guns i mean 
They shoot many gun. They shoot many bullet. Oh, of course we are. Alright, let's start this. Because we're already bot dropped. Alright, cleared some of them. Uh, the orbital laser should finish that. I actually probably won't finish that because uh, it's going to get distracted with uh, the drops. In that case, let's do this. Perfect throw. You should be safe-ish. I threw you in a direction that was not safe. I am so sorry. I missed? Oh, it didn't miss. There's just more there. Also, that artillery is not yet dead. Oh, where is this thing? I don't have... There's another dropship there. I was going to say, I've got an auto cannon, which doesn't really break it very easily, but I got it. They say, you gotta watch the angles on that. You gotta get the flat spot, or else it doesn't actually break it. I should not be on top of this thing. And so you get shot from every angle. This thing's over there. You should make an orbital barrage that and just launches a bunch of hell pods. What I saw from one of the leaks I did see is the uh, I, I shouldn't I shouldn't talk about it. It's not worth it. it. I mean it's it's cool, but there's some cool ideas. Really cool ideas. Some of them I love. Really love. Even if they're not the most powerful thing in the world. Why are the light bulbs in this game brought in the sun? Dude, I don't know, but I exterminate them with all, all, uh, haste. Just light bulbs, they need to, they need to go away. I even make sure I have, uh, flashlights on the, my weapons turned off because it's, it's gross. But you have to go in there crafting. Good luck out there. <clears throat> I have a bad habit of having a mortar or gunship bases close to extract. I mean, that's all, that's pure RNG. Kinda of surprised you haven't got walked up on by a patrol yet. Going after bugs? Yes, we are squashing all the uh, all the bugs out of the automaton uh, automaton brain cells, making sure they uh, return to humanity. No more of this rebellion nonsense. What am I looking for here? Uh, we're gonna anger this patrol. Ow! Ow! It just got a burst in my face. Well, that's unfortunate. Alright. Wounded it, didn't break it. as quickly as possible. Alright. This thing still exists. 
But I broke its defenses, so I should be able to just do that. I like how it didn't actually know where it was despite it hitting me. So it uh, turned to shoot at its own dudes when there was an explosion behind it. Which is just funny. <clears throat> Questionable health. <laughs> Finger chili cheese dog minus the dog. Oh, that's intense. Uh, that's uh, going to be on King to pull down Crag, or is it Crag pulling down King? One of the two. Alright, it's going to be on us to pull down both. The Obelisk of Boom is not yet angered. Alright. Uh... I guess we're just gonna ex leave that as is then. Alright, I am vaulting through the wall. Which is interesting. Metals, no super credits. To top everything off. And away we go. Definitely need to split someone off to go north again. The uh, jetpack dudes light you on fire when they explode. Yeah, it's rough. It's real rough because that fire it just kills you in instantaneous time. Cute. This is not a POI that I recognize. This is different. New to me. Thoughts on Dragon's Dogma with or without the drama stuff included? Um, Dragon's Dogma as a game didn't really attract my attention very hard. Uh, so I wasn't intending to play it at least for... Like it was going to be on the list of ones that I would play eventually, just not immediately. And uh, with the drama and the horrible reviews and design and such, I just was not even interested in looking into it beyond that. Like, not even a little bit. So I didn't. That's all there is to it. Pretty certain that creature burned to death while uh, flying in the air toward me. Stagger it, but now I can. Now there is another strategy that works pretty well with the. Uh, what's that? It works pretty well with the uh, riot shield. So you just run a normal rifle, put the riot shield on your back, and never equip it. Because it still works as a riot shield and as a shield on your back. You're just immune to back shots. I am confused at the general lack of patrols that we're encountering. Because we're only facing a fraction of the units we normally feature. And it's weird to me. Well, here comes a patrol, speaking of which. And I can't tell if we got flared or not. Uh, the answer is we're getting flared. Unless... I think Crag got it. I think Crag... Yeah, he did. I can't see. 
think they're dead. Alright, what I want to do is head over here. HUD. Accessibility. Graphics. Display. Gameplay? Could have sworn it was under HUD. There's reticle stuff. Forget how to change. Here we go. Accessibility, reticle color. Green. There it is. Oh, that's so much better. Well, it's not so much better, actually. it doesn't include the circle which is the only real important part uh, did they clear that plan the automatons respawned uh no they invaded from outside our region of space and claimed cyberstan among other things and when they invaded, they didn't just invade. They came in with like a massive invasion fleet and almost made it to Super Earth. So now we're, now we're pushing them back. Because that's entirely unacceptable behavior. Nothing here for us to find except one of these. <sighs> is there ammo in there? Is the question. There is. Let's top off on everything. Give ammo. No stims. Probably shouldn't have stimmed. Alright, I'll let them go clean up the small base. I'll go ahead toward the primary objective. He does have to stop when he's heard. No, I'm entirely convinced that everything that has happened so far is according to the plan that developers have had. And the uh, activities we've done so far is more of an instantiation of the long-term game than anything else. Marking location. <laughs> like, we haven't done anything the devs didn't want us to do. Nothing unexpected has occurred out in the, uh, out in the world map. We're just watching the, uh, initial, the initial stages of the game being set up in real time. Except Creek. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think I don't think that really I don't think they had a strong opinion on that. Like it's they can do whatever they want. Like it's just you leave the players enough room to finagle things around, but like, it is is what it is. It, that's just the Creek is just a meme that the community has uh has gotten stuck on, and they're happy to uh, happy to double down on it. Nothing the devs anticipated half a million. I mean, from a lore, from a lore and like progress perspective, like which planets get captured, how things go down, I think has been fully expected from from launch. How many exactly? Not so much, but. I think what we're what we're seeing here is the devs just doing a like a preseason type experience, where it's they're setting up the board that we're going to be playing on, and uh, that board is uh, being set up to be what is 
being set up to look like what it's going to be for a remainder of the game. Alright, we got a flare, which is great. Which means I can just run over here, collect samples. Uh, finish this off. Finish off this guy. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, you're actually catching up to me. Right. I went past this apparently. Right, one down. You see the haunted automatons. Haunted? I'm unfamiliar with that one, but. Joel has a plan. Trust in Joel. Yes. Oh, I think you've seen the uh, the ones that have all, all the glow, glowy bits but no corporeal elements. Yeah, those are terrifying. Yes, I think we were always supposed to... Uh, we were always supposed to wipe out the automatons. We are always supposed to push the bugs back. Like, we are always supposed to do all the things that happened. And it was just a matter of when how long it took and the uh, specific memes made along the way and that's it like Malevolon Creek probably wasn't the way uh, people reacted to Malevolon Creek probably wasn't intent expected got at least one omniscient creature over here Gonna leave it because it's in the middle of no in the middle of a mess. When the devs wanted us to remove the bots, they're able to move them more north. So the south is free for a I minute mean, come from. I I think it's more detailed than that. As in, they were always expecting us to kill off the bots to begin with. They were always going to have them move north. Like that was always going to be the plan. At no point was it, oh no, we we forgot that we were adding a third faction and therefore need to need to move things and shift things around. No, that was that was never never. That's that's my that's my uh, expectation of the matter. The things that we have control over with as a player are how do we react to madness like the Malevolon Creek. You notice there was a uh, a point added in where there is a uh, we're talking about the great split of the forces between Malevolon and the other the other facility the other planet, which caused a major order to fail. That I think was not plans and they talked about it they mentioned it that because of it uh, but I think there was never a world when we were going to fail to uh, take out the uh, automatons it's just how much flavor do we get along the way The only creature here is one basic walker, one basic dude. And I question what happened to King. Alright, sweet. The Ubania Gambit? Yeah. Blitz, you've been here. Defend drop near. We failed since we as a community were divided. Yep. And that, that creates a bit of a... That commits a bit of a variance in things. But outside of that... I don't, I don't think we really... I don't think any other major events... Was... Uh, 
has been anything less than uh, as exactly planned. Sounds like a firestorm. Oh, someone got flared. Makes sense for them to move that generator at some point. It's, I mean, the, uh, yes, yes. We were, I always expected that to be the main point of contention. <laughs> Something you find really funny is that you're like 90% sure the only reason Tomatons is back is because Arrowhead didn't expect us to beat them so fast. He needed more time to finish the new faction, whatever it may be. I don't think that's true at all. We haven't done anything faster or slower than the uh, than, than they've expected. And you can tell be because there's a total, mechanically, there is a total cap on the amount of progress we can make at any point in time in terms of capturing planets and such. Uh, there is no, there is no, oh, the Americans are online, so they're capturing things faster. That's, that's not how that works. Mechanically, that's not how that works. And throughout the time, throughout the uh, missions, the devs have been adjusting that rate. Quite frequently, in fact. So, we've hardly had any uh, say on the speed at which we capture things. You can actually see the, uh, the rate at which we're allowed to capture. So I, I find it difficult to imagine that we've we've done something beyond the devs' uh, expectation, because they literally managed the the expectation. Oh, it's on fire! Uh, we can only get one player in, so just grab the samples. Whoever's got all the samples needs to go in. And King Benja needs to go in. And everyone else drop your samples if you have any on the extract. Alright. Good god, just the fire from the floor. Just face tanks too. Good god, alright. I think King's got both of them. Hopefully King was the one who got on. Emo instant, we got samples. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> uh so there is a correlation there. Um if the pelican is on fire, only one person is allowed to get on. Everyone else gets left behind. The pelican was on fire, therefore everyone else got left behind. I have seen it where other player I have seen it where it's not been on fire and everyone gets left behind, but in this case it was on fire, therefore everyone gets left behind. So whoever grabs the samples is the one who gets to go on. Not that we're particularly in. Not that we really need samples anymore. Well, some of us still need samples. <laughs> the, cr the, the screaming because uh, because fire. Cycling out? Yes. Oh, you didn't get all the samples. Crag! Crag, why? You left the samples behind. That doesn't matter. We had like 40 samples. <laughs> you picked them. You didn't! Yeah, there was a second pile. The second pile was uh, not up on the platform yet. <sighs> you see, you read 40. Yeah, because King was trying to bring them up. He, King had them physically in his possession. But it wasn't on the, uh, he hadn't brought them over to the area yet. So, that's why it looked like that. Do you even need samples? I know, good question, right? 
All right. So we are doing a brand new group, which means everyone leaves. And then once everyone leaves, we'll be opening it up to more. And if there are more, if there's more room left, then we can uh, get you guys back in here. All right, so who else would like to join? <clears throat> I know Theta is around. Uh, Icicle just hopped in. We've got more. Who, who is available right now to hop in? Hello there, Hawklight. Welcome in. Get in here. We've got one space left. All right. Well played, everyone. Thank you, thank you for joining us for these missions, as we've got even more coming through soon. Ta-da! I like the animations they did for all this stuff. But yeah, Cyberstan is the uh, centerpiece of this. Can you join? Uh, we are, our lobby is full, but we will be able to get you in here in a future a future uh, campaign. Oh, good lord! All right. Uh, these all have extrication. Okay, they don't. Start off with this guy. Welcome in, Hawklight. Let's go. Don't have the code. Uh, turn this on. And there's your code. Go ahead and add that and we'll pick you up next campaign. Uh, yes, for those latency free comms, I will be jumping into recording. If you guys wish to join. There we go. Alright, so you guys can listen in. this mission so much it is quite the good you are I'm very choppy in curses oh i know why do i pick auto cannon or an aa option all right choppiness fixed try that again Chopping is fixed. No. Uh, it's right. not choppy for me. It better no. be fixed. Because I fixed Choppiness it. is good. There's no more choppiness. Let me yeah. try restarting Discord. <clears throat> Alright. Okay, we Have a good night there, Force Field. Good cannon. luck out there. Maybe one of us should change to an AA. Uh, I miss a pick the Quasar. Okay. Auto cannon's a good time. Yeah. I would not recommend the um, incendiary lines. Yeah, against yep. the bots, and especially since the whole fire being bugged thing. Yeah, the, uh, the fire doesn't yeah. currently work unless you're host. Which is unfortunate. Uh, Theta, I would recommend out bringing at least one sentry stratagem. Eh, this um, loadout has worked for one of those missions for me before. Fair yeah, enough. it's fine. I'm not gonna ready up the eagle. That, let's um, go. When Hawklet, uh, Hawklet, uh, can you switch off the incendiaries? Just for reference, Hawklight, there's a bug in the game right now where fire damage doesn't affect creature. It just doesn't work. 
Uh, it right, does work, but dead. only if you're the network host, which is Correct. not always the game host because of how the game does things. Correct. And the incendiaries don't do much against bots anyways. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> last patch, incendiary mines could kill devastators. Ah. If you're the host, yes. Well, yeah. Assuming it's not bugged. <laughs> yeah. Which, it, it'll, it's bugged for three out of four players, so unless you get... Unless you become lobby host, then it's going to be bugged for you and won't do much. So. However, when they're not bugged, it's very, very good. Yes. Time to liberate. Let them Close all the gate. Let them Let them uh, leave the ones behind us open. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. I do the have front the, sh the shield generator, so I can just shoot that behind. Use that for the thing. Put them um, shield generator behind the door, so they yeah, protect each other, maybe. I know. By the way, there's a terminal up here that you can use to start it er um, early. Should I do that? Yeah, but it's better to give yourself time to set up correctly. Yeah, fair. Uh, I've got right door, by the way. Alright, uh... I'm... I'm gonna hang back now, maybe? Or just see where I'm needed. Uh, I mean, there's I only one entrance, well, two, kind of, for the uh, in initial bit, so... I'll just hang back by, um, second door to I, just I catch won't. stragglers. I would not recommend it, but... Yeah, I would just, the, that uh, would just come up here. Like, yeah, I I'll don't go, go further there. back than around this point here. At least until you get pushed back. They, uh, start in. I will also try not to airstrike my allies, but no promises. Would appreciate that. Huh? <laughs> New mission? Yeah, it's really fun. Very simple, but really fun. In. And I like having these emplacements around. Not that I find them super useful, but they're nice to have. Very cool thematics. Yes. And it's out of ammo. Yeah, it really doesn't eat that much damage. I've not found the shield generator to be particularly uh, high value. Left door is broken. Copy. Uh, I 500 kg to Hulk without thinking about how that would do to the doll. Oh. That broke the door right there. Alright, I'll look for a drop coming left side then. And try and eat them. How far is that? Uh, too far. I got the second drop. Huh. You didn't even take out the dropship and they just failed to land and it glitched out, which is funny. <laughs> Still things there. Tank our door. There are substantially I got the tank. Substantially okay. the tank. tank down. It's flying and launching rockets, which is ow. Why are these bots hovering? Oh, I need to get out of these EMS. I don't, I don't think this mission was finished. Yeah. Considering the translucent red cubes around the, <laughs> the objects, I feel like there's some degree yeah. of work in progress here. So far, this has been very chill. Yeah, uh, it's those those mortars are just trying to kill us over here. Uh, sorry about that. They have a mind of their own. Yeah, I know. We like can't defend this door without EMS landing on top of us. I mean, the EMS is fine. It's the regular mortar that's that I'm concerned about. I can live with the EMS doing stuff. It's it's the one that's constantly knocking me back that's causing problems. Well, they're both. 
Right, well, oh, I'm that's going okay, to airstrike this oh, hello. because okay, okay, the right side okay, door is going down. Fall back. Ow. That was a little close. Sorry about that one, Hawk. It did its work, but. Good I'm going to back in second line. Yeah, I think so. <clears throat> Tank dropped inside and a bunch of hulks. Bunch yeah, of Hulk's causing problems now. Hulk. Oh, they just went clean through that. If you guys take out the Hulk's, I got the RS. Boom. Oh. Now, someone put the shields in front, so we can't shoot through it. I destroyed the shield, which gives us an opportunity to shoot back. Thank you. Almost, the mortar literally got very close to killing me. It likes to do that. Tank, tank drop ship. Got it. Alright. Lord have mercy. Uh, there's multiple tanks approaching, it would seem. It's gonna be a beautiful airstrike. It was. Well, I bugged my camera, so now I'm in first person without even aiming. Right? Unbug it. Hmm. That you could shoot the shield? No. No, you cannot. Uh, which makes things difficult. There's things over here. Seeing if my airstrike can take out two um, hulks in the tank. Uh, it took the tank. Uh, it didn't take the tank. It didn't. It took neither the tank nor the nor the hulks. But I threw another one, which took the tank. Thank you. Took one of the hulks. I'm wondering if I should switch out for the um, switch out the cluster. Uh, it's a the little close there. A little close there with the eagle airstrike. Yeah, that was all around you. Uh, I personally would because the cluster doesn't deal heavy damage. Yeah, it's very anti-infantry. It is, and the infantry. Them. I've been running Ford Eagle for um, things like the Eradicate missions, and it works quite well. Oh yeah, for sure. I think it's not bad at all. Airdrop to democracy. Oh, that was beautiful. Oh, Lord have the, mercy. The Hulk I am being a distraction. The Hulk okay. ran right into my Quasar shot. Well, that's nice. It's convenient. Very convenient. I mean, the cluster does take out Devastator. I mean, it damages Devastators. Cool. Usually, it doesn't kill them. What was that? Okay, yeah. In this position, I am very good bot bait here. There's a lot of things that want to kill me. I'm throwing mortars up here. That is a whole lot of explosives. You know, you can put the mortar launcher, like, literally a hundred meters behind us, and it'll still it, it cause rampant damage out here. I guess, yeah. Well, that's just the kind of range it has us. Because up here it has a good chance of getting destroyed, among other things. I just some tanks because I'd weaken them with a grenade. I'm pretty certain that was the mortars. One of the no. many mortars we have just landing on top of them. Yeah, it, we've just got an artillery um, barrage. <laughs> yeah, I'm not having to do much here. Yeah. My eagles Given it the, uh, given it the uh, proper Imperial Guard treatment. Artillery everywhere. Oh, we, we have eviscerators inside us here. Yes, we do. Crap. Hulk, close. Not anymore, this it's not. Doing the tank no longer exists. Can you imagine the kill streak of the 380? Unironically, would probably be very effective here. I was considering it, but. I also long have a very as you... fun meta of my own. Yeah, as long as you uh, throw it far enough yeah, away that it doesn't hit it. us. If you if the supply is off cooldown, throw it. 
just down somewhere anywhere. Uh, anywhere in our half yeah, of the world. I'm running low on um, auto cannon rounds. Yes. Uh, can you just call down a fresh auto cannon? I can, I didn't think of that. But I am also out of nades and lawns, so. Uh, we, there are two ammo boxes right here. Okay. Find the crate. Mind if I take two supply packs? Knock yourself out. Rocket Devastator. Dead. Hmm. My life with an auto cannon engineer. Pretty much just hunting hulks. Oh, here comes a tank. I see oh, I have been yeeted to the other side of the world. Bunch of, uh, oh, pulp uh, I'm out of stun grenades for that hulk. Trying to hit them in the back, but I'm also ch chased. Let's go behind you. Yep. Yeah. Alright. It looks like we're pushed back to the final hold here. Uh, they go for the door, which is... I can't tell if that's me or not. That is okay. why I closed to the door. Okay, there's no good platform servicing in this door. Eagle's back. Um... I don't have my gear. Without gear, I don't have proper weaponry to deal with this stuff. Why would you go uh, can you destroy Why that shield, please? <laughs> yeah, please destroy that shield if you have an opportunity, because we yep. can't shoot through that. Thank you. The shield basically a bonus door. Yeah. Uh, if only it works in their favor. As soon as they break through, I'm chucking an Eagle 500 in the doorway. Uh, Actually, I'm just chucking an Eagle I'm three minutes slow to get an auto cannon back. I would really like to try to uh, sneak my out. Breach the door. Oh my god, it's... It's bad. Oh, sorry. Yeah, there's no way I can get back up here. Fire uh, if you drop, you if you, yeah, that's a mistake. You can't. Yeah, we need you defending the point. Uh, you may just want to self-destruct unless you have gear that you need to bring up. Just to I get don't. over here faster. I will right. be indiscriminately bombarding that area, yeah. so if you want, I just walk there. I mean, I just kind of ran through it. Oh, there you go. Oof. I'm alive somehow. Uh, pot to our left. Oh, that's a tank! If you devastate or in human. Uh, they're dropping in, in here with us. They landed physically oh on top of me. Hmm. 500 kg. Uh, Running. They're hitting the. They're hitting the shield. We we needed the shield placed onto the uh, yeah, sh energy shield generator. generator. Reinforce. Too much tank. Um, did we lose? Uh, not yet. I am very bugged then. Uh, generator exploded. Oh shit, uh, 78 of 8 rockets. Uh, yeah, we're not dead, we're not out of it yet, but it's getting pretty close. Trying to kill, there's a Hulk punching the generator. Damn it. There we go. That's it. 
Next time I try this, I will bring in auto cannons for you. 